Welcome to Amazing World Channel. A Vatican court on Saturday convicted the former head of the Pope's Children's Hospital of abuse of power for diverting funds to renovate the luxury apartment of a top cardinal. Giuse Profiti, the former president of the Bambino Gesù Children's Hospital, was handed a one-year suspended sentence by a three-judge panel. Prosecutors had asked for a three-year sentence on embezzlement charges. The court has been hearing the case since July. Profiti was charged with diverting €422,000 $500,000 from the hospital foundation to fund renovations to the apartment of Cardinal Tau Sissio Burton, the former secondized official in the Vatican under Pope Benedict XVI. The hospital's treasurer, Massimo Spina, was acquitted. The case highlighted waste at a time when Pope Francis seeks to end extravagance and opaque finances within the Catholic Church. Read more German Bling Bishop avoids trial, compensation prosecutor Roberto Zanotti said in closing statements that the spending revealed the opacity, silence and poor management of Vatican assets. An investment Burton retired in 2013, shortly after Francis became Pope. He received a 400 square meter 4,305 square foot luxury retirement apartment that offers stunning views over St. Peter's Basilica and sits just above France's modest apartment. The renovations were carried out between November 2013 and May 2014. Profiti argued in court that the hospital funds were used to turn the apartment into a place where fundraising events could be held to benefit the hospital and were, therefore, not illegal. Burton, who was not indicted, also contributed to the renovations. Investing is not the same thing as spending, defense lawyer Antonello Blasi said in his closing statement. For his part, Burton has said he approved the project, but that he didn't know of the hospital's payments. He contributed €300,000 of his own funds towards the renovations, in addition to the €422,000 from the hospital. The trial also showed that Burton hired a construction company belonging to his friend, Gian Antonio Bandera, to do the renovations and skirted around normal contracting practices. Bandera's construction firm went bankrupt, but another Akbust company with ties to his firm completed the job and was paid €422,000. Bandera and Burton were not indicted, but the trial and verdict could give prosecutors enough evidence to open a new case. Burton made a €150,000 donation to the hospital when the scandal first emerged in 2015. CWSMSAFP, AP, DPA, Reuters.